Hello guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Gift Ogu and if this is your first time of watching any of my videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. It is 3 17 a.m. Nigerian time and I just thought that I should bring you guys a very hot and sizzling gist. You guys know that I work from home so I am working late today. It's 3 um, 17 a.m. and I just thought to check Twitter and and I saw that Gloria say it's trending. <laughs> Gloria and her husband like you do even know that Gloria is married like I had no idea. Let me break your heart. She's married to a Muyawa Fuller show or something like that. I knew Glory because I knew her brand. She has like a lot of. She runs like so many businesses in Lagos, Pop Money, like just a whole lot of businesses in Lagos. She runs so many businesses in Lagos and most popular of them is Land Lagos, which I've actually even gone for an interview in before. And I know someone that basically worked there and he didn't really have like a good story to tell. I asked him, he just told me that it's a toxic environment and somehow I was happy that I did not get to work there. So like as I was, as I was saying earlier, like I went to Twitter to check what was going on, you know, we need to like chill after working and go back to work because you cannot just work like straight up. And I found out that Glory is trending, that she does not pay salary. Like, Glory is like an, a social media influencer. Her tweets actually make sense. She's at the forefront of Nigerian feminism, Nigerian social media feminism, actually. She's at the forefront of it. And Glory being dragged in this whole social media mess is like, oh my god oh my god like i don't even really believe it because she's a role model to a whole lot of people not me anyway but to so many people so this whole thing started when glory actually made it sweet that she's actually recruiting and restructuring and she has positions in lagos for a writer a hr manager and all that so a former employee of her has called her out on social media saying oh so you and me you can wake up one morning and fire everyone like you did last month then start the recruitment process all over again don't you get tired clowns you should also let your fans know that you're a married woman there first of all i do not even know that glory was married second of all like she's I see her as like an influencer that people actually look up to and the fact that she does not really you know pay her salary is um, pay workers their salary is like sad but first i wanted to dismiss it saying oh maybe this person is actually chasing clouds but when a lot of her past um, workers that have been fired and have gone through a whole lot of stuff that working with her and her husband started opening up on twitter and writing how the, their life was a living hell you have to like sign a memor memorandum of understanding that you're not going to like work for any other related brand or create your own brand that is related to any of their brands i knew that something was fishy also a friend of mine worked with them and when i asked him why he resigned he was like i won't understand that it's just like it was a toxic place at all and a whole lot of people on twitter have been saying that it's a toxic place they've they didn't get their sanity when they were basically working there and just a whole lot of stuff yeah, that it's not like her husband is any better like they are better the same feathers basically and i read one of the husband's article on post on social media where he said that 90 percent of the people he has worked with are thieves like <laughs> that's sad everyone that has been calling glory out has been calling her husband out too so i'm just going to wait till the day breaks to see what she's going to see as she regards this and how she's going to reply this and her reason for firing people every time and owing them salaries and living her best life on social media i heard that all her businesses are full of uh, scams but i know that rmd is like the ambassador for land legal so i don't really know i don't really know much about this whole story but let's see how this case unfolds i'm going to keep you guys posted my friend is sleeping and i'm waiting for him to be up so that i can actually ask him a whole lot more about this issue and he can tell me from a personal point of view what went down i'm so busy at this point i'm going to keep you guys updated on what's happening you guys know <laughs> so thank you so much for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe
bring you guys more information when the day breaks don't forget to subscribe remember it does not cost you anything and it only takes five seconds of your time so thank you so much for watching bye